Welcome to the Memento M. Cristo channel, it's great to have you here. The prayer of St. John the Baptist against enemies is a Catholic prayer that seeks the protection of St. John the Baptist against spiritual and physical enemies. It is based on the belief that St. John the Baptist was a powerful and courageous man who fought against the forces of evil during his lifetime. The prayer begins with an invocation to St. John the Baptist, asking him to help us resist the attacks of our enemies. Next, we ask St. John the Baptist to protect us from all forms of evil and from all temptations of the devil. Finally, we ask St. John the Baptist to grant us the necessary strength and courage to face our enemies and overcome them. It is important to remember that this prayer is a way of asking for divine protection and does not encourage violence or anger against others. It is a prayer to strengthen yourself spiritually and resist the temptations of evil. It is recommended to pray this prayer with faith and devotion, always seeking God's guidance. Let's open our prayer St. John the Baptist with the prayer of the Our Father. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive to those who have offended us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Prayer of St. John the Baptist against enemies. St. John the Baptist, you are the only one who can help me. Out of affection and kindness, don't let me get confused in life, suffering from other people's evil and envy. Put it far away from my life, say the person's name, he doesn't know how to be kind or nice to me, besides doing me a lot of harm. I ask him to make him scared to death of crossing my path, I don't want him to stay by my side anymore and I don't want him to try to reconcile with me in the future. Don't let his presence linger in my life, what I want most is his distance and all the peace I deserve. To St. John the Baptist I pray, I know that he will answer me even without my merit, not because I am good, but because you are kind. I trust in your power to help me have a much more peaceful life. Don't let me get nervous and worried about this person. Make him stop looking for me and be part of my life, right now I need peace of mind and focus. I can't stand living with this person disturbing me and taking away my peace, make him feel intimidated by the light of God that dwells in me. I don't want him bad, but distancing. I trust in Christ who governs me. Order it now. Plead, Lord, with those who plead with me, fight against those who fight against me. Take shield and wheel, and rise to my aid. Take away the spear and obstruct the way of those who pursue me, say to my soul, I am your salvation. Let those who seek my life be confounded and put to shame, turn back and be ashamed of those who try to harm me. Be like chaff before the wind, the angel of the Lord make them flee. Let their way be dark and slippery, and the angel of the Lord may pursue them. Because without cause they hid from me the net in the pit, which they dug for my soul without reason. Destruction come upon him without knowing it, and catch him in the net he hid, let him fall into that same destruction. And my soul shall rejoice in the Lord, will rejoice in his salvation. All my bones will say, Lord, who is like you, who delivers the poor from him who is stronger than he? Yes, the poor and needy of him who robs him. False witnesses arose, they testified against me things that I did not know. They turned me evil for good, stealing my soul. But as for me, when I was sick, my clothes were sackcloth, I humbled my soul with fasting, and my prayer returned to my bosom. I behaved as if he were my brother or friend, he was weeping and bowed low, as one weeping for his mother. But they at my adversity rejoiced and gathered together, the abject were gathered together against me, and I knew it not, they tore me apart, and did not cease. 
With mocking hypocrites at parties, they gnashed their teeth against me. Lord, how long will you see this? Rescue my soul from its ravages, and my favorite from lions. I will praise you in the great congregation, among many people I will honor you. Let not my enemies rejoice over me without reason, nor wave their eyes at those who hate me without cause. For they do not speak of peace, rather they plan to deceive the quiet of the earth. They open their mouth wide against me, and say, Ah! Oh! Our eyes have seen him. You, Lord, have seen it, do not be silent, Lord, do not be far from me. Awake and awake to my judgment, to my cause, my God and my Lord. Judge me according to your righteousness, Lord my God, and do not let them rejoice over me. Do not say in your hearts, Ah! Our soul. Do not say, We have devoured him. Let them be ashamed and confounded together that rejoice in my evil, let them be clothed with shame and confusion that magnify themselves against me. Let them sing and be glad that love my righteousness, and say continually, The Lord be magnified, who loves the prosperity of his servant. And so my tongue will speak of your righteousness and your praise all day long. Psalms 35 Thank you for watching this video about St. John the Baptist's prayer against enemies. Don't forget to turn on notifications on our channel and leave a like so you don't miss any updates and continue receiving important content like this. Thank you.